In this video, we are going to learn about conditional horizontal targets. Uh, actually, conditional horizontal target means we have two conditions whether when we have target found condition and uh, target not found condition. This target is a width target which has a horizontal uh, width parameter. So, in my screen on the right side, I have this normal lane arrangement here I have the lane here then after that I have this another lane so my target is set if you if we found this with target it will apply this assembly if you don't found this target it will apply this assembly the corridor comes that corridor comes up to here then it is searching for this target this target if it founds it will apply this assembly if it does not found that this target that means somewhere here it will apply this one so i, I currently only have uh, the i define one side so i will define the other side uh, so if you have to go to tool palettes then go to conditional then go to conditional horizontal target then you can set it here now it is target found condition so if the target found condition you have to change the name first this is the right side and these are the normal parameters i am not going to in that one and I click OK then if the target found I have this one then I will add the target not found condition I will add it here but it will coincide with the next one so I have to click here so if you don't have two options here just turn on your uh, selection cycling you can see we have two options here then you can select one and set it to change the side then set it to target not found click ok and click ok again now the target not found will go to the upside now you have to mirror these two to the other side for target not found case and press escape Select these three, these three assemblies, then mirror to the other side to for target found case. Then we are going to rename these assemblies one by one. Now my this lane is lane L2 because it is the second lane. Shoulder is also shoulder L2. And this one daylight. R. This is shoulder L2 because this one is shoulder L1. This is for target not found case. This one should be R and this one should be also R. I think I have forgot to rename this one as L2 and this one should be actually R2, not L2. And shoulder is also the same. R2. Now my corridor is OK. I will close this one. Now my assembly is OK. So now I, uh, I am going to this corridor from to prospector and right click and go to properties and go to parameters tab i need to set the targets now i click this one to me make it activate and go to set all targets and i am going to set the target first i will set the eg targets first and then i have already set up the left side now i am going to set up the right side my conditional horizontal target right side would be for this lane. 
of this lane i am going to the other viewport and select this lane and click ok and the other one also target not found case should be the same and shoulder r should be this one this is the first target not found shoulder and shoulder lane r2 should be this one and finally shoulder r2 should be this one so after setting all these parameters i click ok and click ok again to run the corridor now you can see in this here my corridor automatically goes to the other lane when it found this target so you have two lanes here now if i go to uh, section view editor if i select here and go to uh, section view editor so you can see after first 3.6 you have another 3.6 you have two assemblies uh, two lanes here if you move on to the previous assembly you can see another two lanes are here if you go move on further you can see now only you have one lane so when it found the target it will move on to two lanes so that is how to add conditional horizontal targets into uh, civil 3d